Hey guys, so in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to get the Morse code for the Crystal Key really, really fast. Okay, so here's what you need. You need one of three things. A iPhone, an Android phone, or an OBS Studio, a screen recorder, okay? So, for the iPhone, you use something called a light conversation application, and that's going to allow you to decode the lantern without having to do anything. With the Android phone, you're going to download something called a Morse code encoder decoder from the Play Store. And that's going to do, allow you to do the same thing. It's going to use the camera to basically record the lantern and it's going to detect it and it's going to translate it for you guys, okay? Or if you don't have either phones, um, you're going to use something called the screen recorder, right? So the OBS Studio. So you're going to record uh, the screen, okay? And once you record the screen, you're going to slow it down and you're going to actually detect it manually, okay? So now if, you're right, if, if you have the two phones, then great. Now, if you want to manually detect it, here's how you re record the Morse code. Okay, so the light is going to blink, and uh, there's going to be four characters that you need to have. Okay, so you're going to need uh, four characters. So remember, there's going to be four characters that the light lantern is going to give you. Okay, so what I recommend is to actually have using two numbers. Okay, so you're going to use number one, and you're going to use number two. Okay, so when it blinks fast, you're going to use that as number one. If it blinks long, you're going to use number two. Okay, so uh, when you do this, there's going to be basically t pauses every time it switches over to the next character. Okay, so once it switches to the next character, you, if you already missed the first one, just jump to the next one. Okay, so you're going to see the quick pause, and it's going to be um, quite, a, uh, quite a bit long. So it's going to be like about a second or a little bit longer. Um, it really depends, but it's really, really hard to detect it with the bare eye. So... I recommend using a screen recorder and then slowing it down. So if you have a camera anywhere in the house, use that camera to your advantage, okay? So that's how you're going to basically detect the code, okay? And then once you get the code, so once you write it down and you get the code, you're going to use a translator, okay? A Morse code translator. And I'm going to post it in this video so you guys can see it. And then um, all you have to do is actually just translate. So the dot is just number one, which is the short, and the long is the number two okay so literally all you have to do is read this uh, if you read one two two it's gonna be right here it's gonna be this letter right here and then all you have to do is write that letter down for that letter okay so literally that's how you do it. it's really really simple and um, you know I hope this helps you guys in, in, in some way uh, if you have any questions go ahead and post it down and I will try my best to explain it to you okay so that's how you do it guys and uh, I hope this helps thanks for watching bye Thank you.